Finally accomplished the most important thing in my life, which is giving back to these children a chance to become great. Greatness starts with education, and a foundational education should not come with a financial barrier. Why I go down in Saban? This is where my life started. This is where my mother was born, right here on this floor that we're sitting on.
started in 2001 when I came back to Miller for the first time after being born to America. I remember walking around the village and seeing little children hanging around during school hours. And I never understood why these kids were in school. And I found out I was living in the fourth school, by the government school, the school field. And I said to myself, one day, I'm going to do something about this. And here we are, 20 years later, Michael Blackson Academy. I want our children to be able to dream big, just like I did. School brought me discipline and built me a path to dream big. I remember seeing our President John before inauguration on television when I came back to Ghana for the first time since I left for the point, 2001. And I said to myself, this guy looks so brilliant, I want to meet this guy one day. About six months ago, I had a chance to sit down with him and, and talk about my vision about the school with him. I don't think I would have had that confidence enough to sit alongside him if I never had a chance to get an education. My wish for all the children is to become brave and dream. No dream is impossible to me, as long as you don't give up. Now here we are, Michael Blackson Academy. Regardless of the economic background, you should not be too proud of your education. By the grace of God, we are all here in this together. We want to keep working hard to keep this going on forever. And it's just the beginning. From the plan of building one here, of course, I'm going to go to Liberia and we should I'm not going to type some bad or ask for anything. If anybody wants to help, you're welcome to help. But if you want to buy me anything like this year, I want to pay for the TV uniform, I want to buy that clothes, I want to pay for the TV game. Anybody is welcome to help. It's going to be a team effort. It takes a village, that's right. Who you, my close guy? But I couldn't have this happen without thinking the most important people that made us all happen for me. I gotta thank my mother. First and foremost, you know, my mother didn't have money to give us when she did and she gave me the most important thing, which is God. She told me about God, and that's how we are here today. And the word says, teach the kid the way he should go, and you know he had. Now I thank my mom for showing God in me. I want to thank the chief and the queens and the mothers, everybody for giving me a blessing today. I want to thank the Board of Education also for allowing me and also giving me a blessing. I want to thank CBS for getting involved and helping me finish up this wonderful project. I want to thank my team, my fiance Robin that helped pull us together, all my friends from the diaspora. Tina, Dr. Jovina, my roommates and everything. Everybody came from Liberia, everybody from the States, New York, Atlanta, DC, my Nigerian homies. Father, Leo. I want to thank all of you for being here today. Thank you, thank you, you're welcome. And I want to thank the most important person of all, God, for making this happen, for his blessings. You know, for the book on first, first, book on first, and trust me, whatever in life you want will be accomplished. You know, I got those four flags out there, and this flag should be everything to me. Of course, Ghana is my blood, like the bear that raised me, and the children gave me some discipline, and the United States taught me how to give back. And I thank all of you for being here tonight, and let's celebrate. Thank you.